Hi, my name is Michelle from the Start.ca Service Desk, and today I'm going to go over how billing works when you're a Start.ca customer and talk about our payment options. Start.ca is a bit different from other internet providers, especially when it comes to how we bill for our services. We operate on a pay-as-you-go system. Rather than billing you for your previous month of service, this means you're always billed for the upcoming month's worth of service. It's that simple. One of the nicest benefits of a pay-as-you-go system is that there are no contracts and you can cancel your service at any time. Now when it comes to payment, we have lots of options. We accept credit cards, visa debit, and even direct withdrawal. For business customers specifically, terms and invoicing options may also be available. So in a system like this, what happens if you go over your plan's monthly bandwidth? How do we charge you for that? The good news is we only have a few internet service plans that aren't already unlimited. So for most customers, this will never be an issue and your bill won't fluctuate from month to month. If you're still on one of our few remaining limited bandwidth plans and you do go over, you'll see an additional charge owing on your next month's bill. Speaking of which, if you are on a bandwidth capped plan and find yourself going over often, give us a call. We would be happy to look at what other options might be available to you. If you're simply looking for fast, friendly and reliable internet, give us a call and we'll help you find a start.ca solution that fits. Do you have questions about your bill or your internet connection in general? Don't hesitate to call us or visit start.ca to send us an email. You can also get help on social media. Visit our website for those links. Thanks for watching. Check out our other videos, subscribe and keep up with the latest from start.ca.